Bicycle shops in Boise have been slammed. They've had more business than they know what to do with over the past several weeks. Tonight we are tracking what people have been spending their money on during the COVID-19 pandemic. Welcome to the Sunday News at 10. Did you hit the stores this weekend? Maybe finally got your hair cut, your nails done. This weekend, gyms, salons and dine-in restaurants opened back up for business. But up until this point, we've been mostly confined to our homes, only leaving to shop for essential items or shopping online. And as our Gretchen Parsons reports, you may be surprised to find out what a lot of Idahoans consider essential. Gretchen, what'd you learn? Well, Kim, spoiler alert, it's not just toilet paper people are stocking up on. I spoke with the CEO of a Boise and Seattle based credit card processing company who shed some light on what people are buying right now. Since mid-March, Dan Price, the CEO of Gravity Payments, a credit card processing company, he's able to track what people are buying during this pandemic. Some industries that have taken a hit may not surprise you. Restaurants are still down about uh, in the high 60s, 65, 68 percent. At the bottom, they were down by 77 percent. Individual restaurants that are using like our online ordering system, they're doing on average double the business of restaurants that are not. Nationally, people aren't shopping for new outfits. Clothing has been down, has been hit really hard. So clothing has been down 70, 80 percent plus uh, since the pandemic started. Or booking a trip. The businesses that are most squeezed are any type of events business or travel business. Many of those have gone down to zero. But data shows that many people consider alcohol essential during this time. It has skyrocketed. Um, you know, in some weeks has been as much as two to three hundred percent of what it typically is. That could be a little bit of business that's shifting away from restaurants to liquor stores. Gun and ammunition sales are also skyrocketing. Gun sales also were through the roof, um, especially toward the beginning part of the, the pandemic. And in Boise specifically? Bicycle shops are up almost 200% from their normal sales. And I wonder if it's just, you know, people are home, they can't go to the gym, so they're exercising outdoors, especially with the weather getting nicer. After all, we are one of the biggest cycling communities in the Northwest. Price added that he expects to see restaurant sales locally and nationally slowly start to pick up now that those businesses have started to reopen. Price also said that garden type stores in the Treasure Valley have also seen a lot of business and that could be because of the season, but that could also be because stores like Lowe's and Home Depot were some of the few stores that have been able to stay open the whole time. So if you were there before other retail stores were able to open, you probably noticed that they were slammed or at least I did. OK, Gretchen, I'm not surprised about the alcohol. I'm not surprised. Am I? <laughs> I'm not surprised maybe about the gun sales. Uh, and clothing, but bikes? I know. That is very interesting. interesting. Really great report. Thank you so much, Gretchen.